Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, humans and aliens, my name is the Psychochemist of today. We got a story video for you guys now. I wanted to do this video because number one, I thought it would be a little bit easier. Now, you're probably wondering why I'm like, sounding like absolute potatoes and fries and all that stuff. Well, um, let's see. Um, my mic messed up when I actually like did this recording on my PlayStation, so that's why I'm doing recording on this specifically. So uh, ignore like everything that's happening right now. So uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you guys do, make sure to leave a like. Uh, also hit that subscribe button if you're new. Uh, let's get into it. So this started when I was a little kid. I was at Beach Martin Elementary School. Um, and I think it was like first grade because I was actually like, um, because I was like maybe seven or eight at the time, and we were walking towards my grandmother's house because that's where I lived at the time. And um, when I lived there, uh, everything was a little bit different. Uh, I started getting through a ton of issues there, but I'm gonna get to that later. So basically. As we were walking home, um, I saw my brother at my favorite store, which we get those little Coca-Cola bottles, and that was my favorite part of my childhood, and I loved it. So, as I saw him, I saw him in tears, and as I was seeing that, I was like, what's wrong with my brother? I should go comfort him. I should go help him. So, what I did is... I was grabbing uh, somebody else's, my uncle's hand, so I was grabbing my uncle's hand, and one of my uncle's hand, and it, I, he told me not to go over there, and I said, I have to help him, I have to, he said, you can't do that, it's, he's gonna have to handle this like a man, and I couldn't let him do that, I just didn't hear him, I blocked him immediately, so I ungrabbed from his hand, and I ran across the street, and I pushed the bully out of his way, and I said, leave him alone, stop bullying him. I was like brave enough to tell him that. And he said, oh, what are you going to do about it, huh? What are you going to do about it? You're just a sad little shrimp. Keep in mind, I was a little kid at the time. And most importantly, um, I was so small to the point where I was like little to the high school kids. So. I'm like six foot now, so I'm not even gonna go there, but basically, as I was going through that, he immediately told me to get out of the way, and I told him, no, get away from him, and I kept pushing him and pushing him, and I just told him to go away, and then after that, he said, fine, brave little boy, what, you got your brother to protect you? Pathetic. He's not pathetic, you are! And that's what I said. And... Basically, I got pushed down to the ground. And he said, Come on guys, let's go. I don't have to deal with this crap. And then he left. So pretty much after that, I went to my brother, and I asked him if he was okay. He said, yeah. That's pretty much it. And during that time, guys, it was difficult. I didn't want to go through it to be honest, and I felt a little ashamed that I had to go through it anyway, so, yeah, so, that's pretty much it, um, uh, what really inspired me to do this video was the fact that I wanted to do more stories like I used to, and, and it was time for me to do that, so, yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed the video, if you guys do, make sure to leave a like, also comment down below if you guys want to see more of these videos, I'll see you guys next time, goodbye. I can't just